Good Monday morning to you. Meteorologist Elizabeth Copeland heading out the door today. We are tracking some highs back in the 70s. A little bit of rain and forecast for the Rocky Mountains and the Rocky Mountain front down into Helena. But overall, a little bit more of that sunshine than clouds for most of the state today. Again, back in the mid 70s, right about average this time of year. But high pressure is going to keep most of the rain out of the north and east. A little upper level trough is going to set off some showers across the Rocky Mountain front into Cut Bank and hello, right about 3:30 or so. We see that peak heating time that allows us to heat up quite a bit. And then high pressure is going to kick out those showers later tonight and in tomorrow. But big changes are definitely on the way by midweek. So warm weather is going to stay around the state through Tuesday. A cold front is going to push through by Wednesday, kicking out that colder air. And then we'll see some wind behind that. Cooler air settles in for Wednesday night. And then by Thursday, storms kick up more widespread than today and tomorrow, and cooler weather is going to stick around for a while. So as that front moves through, chances really ramp up Thursday through Saturday of those scattered thunderstorms. Only a few chances here or there today and tomorrow. Most of those, again, staying through the Rocky Mountain front. And temperatures are going to take a drop as well. So as that cool weather settles in, we'll take about a 20 degree drop in most areas, even down to about 10 degrees below average on Friday, slowly warming up through next week, but expect a big change to move in by Wednesday into Thursday as that cold front moves in, dropping temperatures and increasing rain chances.